At the convocation ceremony of Michael and Cecilia Ibro University, Agbara Utho, in Ugeli North, local government area of Delta State, Peter Ego, the former executive director of the Nigerian Television Authority, called on graduates to look beyond the challenges of their immediate environment and embrace the culture of patience and consistent hard work. You must work hard for everything if you want to succeed. There is no free meal. You must go there, just God says, I don't want nobody to give me nothing, open up the door, and I'll take it myself. Go out there and fend to your best. As we celebrate our second and third set of graduating students today, we remain committed to providing a world-class education that is suitable and adaptable to our fast-changing world. Dear graduates, I would like to remind you that education is a lifelong pursuit. It is therefore crucial that you do not rest on your words. In today's knowledge-based economy, the Chancellor of the University, Cecilia Ibro, says youths must continuously develop themselves to remain relevant and be able to take advantage of the many opportunities that still abound despite the harsh economic conditions brought about by the coronavirus pandemic. In the name of the Senate Council and in accordance to the provisions of the university statutes, I confer on you, sir, the honorary degree of Doctor of Letters, honorary course of the Michael and Cecilia Union University, Agbara Auto, with the rights and privileges attached thereto. Congratulations. It's good to have knowledge. Knowledge is good. But more than knowledge, you also need to uh, uh, hard work. But on top of the hard work, a lot of sacrifice. Because for many of us who are in broadcasting, um, as you heard me say, while we are out there making people happy, our families are suffering. For many, many months, my wife is alone in the house, bringing up children. My children are growing up without me. And it's that sacrifice, the hard work, the tears, the pains that are paying off today. Chief Dr. Peter Ego is my son and he has been uh, a pride to me and to Urubu Nation and to Nigeria in endless award. And that is my happiness and the happiness of everybody. My advice to the youths and these graduates is that they should not have a feeling of regret or that the nation is not. No, it will only get better. Let them agitate for it, for it, let them insist on it, let them demand what is their right as it is in other countries of the world. Jemima Boloko, Arise News.